What's the use of holding a bucket which has a hole in it and trying to fill water through that bucket? You will never be able to collect enough water. You will definitely end up wasting twice as much water than the amount of water you collect, if not more. That's the exact same situation that happens when your mindset is negative, when you are in you are investing a lot of time in situations which are negative while you're also trying to manifest. That's literally like driving with your hand brakes on. That is an example that I keep giving all the time. Or you're just driving in two opposite directions and you're trying to reach the destination faster. Not going to happen. It's always going to be one step ahead and two steps back. But instead of trying to tell you all the possible things that negative mindset can bring to your life is not going to help. I would rather focus on trying to help you achieve the right mindset, give you easy trips and tips and tricks, hacks, which are going to help you change your mindset for the positive. I'm going to talk to you about five ways which are going to help you eradicate one negative habit, one negative feeling, emotion out of your life one at a time because only when you eliminate negativity are you going to get a give a boost to your law of attraction practice. That's literally what you need more than anything. So get ready with a positive mindset and get ready to muster the courage to get rid of all the possible negativity out of your life one step at a time, one day at a time, one hack at a time, one trick at a time. Hello and welcome. This is the 22nd episode of Manifest with Paycheck to Profit. I am Manish Aouja, your money mindset and financial literacy coach, founder of Paycheck to Profit. Paycheck to Profit is a community for millennials and Gen Zs. We are bringing all the people together, helping them how to build a new positive mindset with the relationship, a new relationship with money altogether. More on that a little later, but let's start with the first thing that you can and you definitely must do to eliminate negativity out of your life. Now, how do I, how did I build a positive relationship with money and how did I end up getting into this positive mind frame all the time? One thing that definitely has helped me is consuming a lot of positive content as much as possible. There's this movie called Guru. G-U-R-U. It's a Hindi movie where Abhishek Bachchan plays character of Dhirubhai Ambani. It's loosely based on the life of founder of Reliance Industries Limited, one of the, big, the biggest company in India. I have seen that movie n number of times. In fact, I watch it at least once every year just to motivate me. And it, it's just a movie that brings me a lot of happiness. I went ahead and found this book. A very big reason why I am an entrepreneur today is because of this book. Pour your heart into it. A book by Howard Schultz. The he's not necessarily the founder of uh, Starbucks. He is the chairman, and he was the CEO of Starbucks for the longest time. It's his journey. How a coffee salesman ended up buying Starbucks from its original founders and ended up building a company that we all know of today. Like it, love it, hate it. We can have different arguments over that. But watching, consuming, surrounding myself with positive content has helped me inherently build the mindset where I try to look for the silver lining in the crowd cloud. I end up finding solutions and I focus towards solution rather than focusing towards problems. It's very, very, very important to consume a lot of positive content, negative content with regards to seeing people who are greedy, people who don't who think of rich people to be negative or bad in any way. It's not helping you. Please be very mindful and consume only positive content. The second thing that you can do in this situation to boost your uh, law of attraction and eliminate negativity out of your life is to educate yourself. Educate yourself. There are so many good content creators today helping you with financial literacy, with uh, how do you build your wealth. Watch their content. Harass them with comments and ask them all the questions that you can because a good quality content creator is always going to be happy to help their community. So always try and connect with these content creators and learn whatever you can. Educate yourself. Reach out to me if you have any questions. Read better books. Now this is one book that I keep talking about with positive 
माइंड सेट ऑल द टाइम इट्स द पावर ऑफ द सबकॉन्शियस माइंड प्लीज कीप रीडिंग एंड एडुकेटिंग योर सेल्फ विद रिगार्ड्स टू पॉजिटिव माइंड सेट मनी माइंड सेट फिनेंशियल लिटरेसी इन्वेस्टमेंट एनी थिंग दैट कैन हेल्प यू स्टे अवे फ्रॉम नेगेटिविटी द थर्ड थिंग दैट यू कैन डेफिनेटली डू इज जर्नलिंग now again please journal on a daily basis this is not supposed to be an intermittent practice this is not something that you should do only when you feel like and in fact i personally journal multiple times a day i get into this practice called morning habits although i'll be very honest with you i don't practice morning habits on a regular basis i'm going to do that very soon but i journal all the time i journal every day and journaling helps you clean your mindset cleanse your mindset it helps rome was not built in a day right similarly a positive mindset is not going to be built in a day you will have to keep chiseling yourself you will have to keep working towards creating a new lifestyle for yourself you will have to work towards exposing yourself to positive ideas and journaling is the easiest gateway to exposing yourself to what is bothering you and how do you solve it journaling is going to help you get the clarity that the, the clarity in the direction that you're supposed to take with regards to your money mindset one more thing that is definitely going to give you a lot of clarity is becoming a part of the profit clan what is profit clan profit clan is the email newsletter uh, community of paycheck to profit everything that goes out in the public domain with regards to paycheck to profit get shared with the profit clan first i'm going to restart my journey of creating a lot of uh, youtube videos talking about money mindset and financial literacy on paycheck to profit's youtube channel so again all the paycheck to profit uh, profit clan members are going to start getting a lot of emails regarding that so if you're not a part of the profit clan you can go and check the show notes below the like button and you can definitely you should definitely sign up for the profit clan community a lot of exclusive content also get shared on email because i can't share everything on social media with regards to keeping in mind about the algorithm about what is sensitive what should not be shared on social media there are a lot of rules but on profit clan it's literally a community that i own so everything that i have to share i can go more raw and unfiltered on profit clan make sure that you're a part of profit clan the fourth thing that you definitely must do that is going to help you the most to eliminate negativity out of your life is actually by eliminating negative people out of your life i say this with a smile but nothing has helped me more than the amount of time that i have saved the amount of energy that i have saved by eliminating a few negative people out of my life now i know this may not be possible for everybody and this may not even be something that you would be happy to do but some things have to be done because it's important rather than what you like doing or what you don't like doing it's absolutely your choice i will not tell you to eliminate people out of your life that is going to be a personal choice as i said but you can definitely you should definitely try to find yourself a new mastermind of people a new group of people who have the right mindset who have similar goals towards progressing getting better at their life so try finding better people in your life network with more people surround yourself with more positive people as much as you can if you want to get better at investing in stocks find people who are already investing and are profitable who are investing not trading first of all it's difficult to find people with the right mindset so find coaches find communities where you can find similar people work towards it this may take time this may not be easy to do but if you connect with the right communities this can definitely help and if you are really serious about connecting with the people with the right mindset make sure you connect with uh, people in the profit clan community or connect with uh, attend the next master class that i keep doing every sunday and for all you know i will help you figure a way to connect with all like minded people from the paycheck to profit community the fifth and the most important thing that you need to focus on is to change your negative mindset you have to understand where does the negative mindset come from more often than not negative mindset is a result of negative self worth if you don't feel very good about yourself if you look at yourself in the mirror and you don't feel happy about it if you don't smile when you look at yourself if you feel that you as a person are not the best thing that has happened obviously if you, if you start thinking that you are the best thing that has happened in the planet that may become narcissistic that is narcissistic but 
you have to be the best version of yourself. You have to feel proud of the journey that you've had. You have had. You need to feel proud of what you have achieved and the the direction in which you are taking your life in. To help you improve your relationship with yourself. How can you improve your self worth? Do check the show notes below because I am going to share one of my past episodes, episode number 12, which will help you understand how can improving your self-worth improve your law of attraction practice. It's one of my most favorite episodes of the podcast. So do not miss that episode if you've not heard it. Even if you've heard it after this episode, listen to that episode because it will give you a new fresh perspective on the same subject. Let me very quickly consolidate all the five points for you. First, consume a lot of positive content. Be mindful of all the content that you're consuming today. If you come across anything that is negative, just get it out of your life. Spend more time consuming a lot of positive content. Second, educate yourself. Figure out good content creators. Figure out good books. Figure out good places where you can go to. And educate yourself with regards to financial literacy, money mindset, positive mindset, everything that you can do about it. Third, get into the practice of journaling. Journaling is amazing. If you have any questions with regards to journaling, feel free to ask me those questions in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to answer them for you. Fourth, be very mindful of spending as much time as possible with positive company, positive people. Fifth is your negative mindset is a byproduct of your negative self-worth. So start focusing on that. And let me give you a bonus point. Keep going and stay consistent because consistency, this journey will get difficult. There will be times when you will want to give up. But when you push through, when you stay consistent, consistency pays with a lot of profit and interest. So do not let go of this practice of consistency. If you have a bad day, take one day off. That's okay. But don't let go of a practice just because you've had one bad day. That is one thing that you will have to be very, very careful for. Listen to this episode multiple times. I know it's just 12 minutes and you may feel that I have preached a lot, but I am looking at myself in your shoes because I was in your shoes a couple of years ago. 2023 has been a very difficult year for me personally and everything that I have mentioned to you, I have somehow practiced it in my life in some capacity or the other. And that is why I am being able to talk to you about all of these points with so much confidence and conviction. I wish you all the luck. I know this is going to be a challenge for you, but if you have managed to listen to this episode till this moment, it is also something that you really want in your life. Otherwise you could have just skipped this episode a long time back. Thank you so much for giving me your time. Please make sure that you follow me on social media across the platforms because I'm posting exclusive content on every social media platform, which is YouTube and uh, Instagram. If you are watching this video, you can also follow Manifest with Paycheck to Profit on a podcast application. And if you are listening to this podcast, you can also watch us watch these videos on YouTube and all other uh, other platforms. If you've liked this episode, please take 30 seconds and give a five star rating to this episode because it takes a lot of effort to make sure that this these episodes reach out to a much wider audience and you sharing uh, you giving a five star review to this particular episode will make sure that it reaches out to 10 more people at least. Take a screenshot of this episode, share it across social media, get let more people get introduced to manifest with paycheck to profit and do not forget to tag pay to pro and Mr. Emojical, which is my personal ID. And I will be very happy to amplify your message to my community. Thank you so much for listening or watching this episode till the end. I will now see you in the next episode, which will release next Monday, 6 a.m. IST. Until then, please take good care of yourself. Stay positive. Keep manifesting. Keep going. Keep growing. Thank you so much.